Anyone from the 80s can remember this game and how much fun it was when it first came out. But did you know that on your Fire TV sticks and your Android boxes, you can get this and many other retro games on that? For all of you that have learned how to put Cody, it's just that simple to put these on your device. And we're going to cover how you can do that and who can teach you how to do that quickly in this video. If you're finding me for the first time, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell so you're down every time we drop these Life Games videos. Today's Life Game, getting you a great Christmas gift for gaming. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy back in the building, bringing you another Life Games video. I have someone who has been on this channel before. I call him Mr. Level by Level Gaming. He thought highly enough to bring his beautiful wife, Miss Level by Level Gaming, and we're going to talk about how to get free games and how gaming can get you girls. But first, Terrence got his plus sevens already. <laughs> Miss Level by Level, do you have some plus sevens? We're going to put on all of our plus seven glasses of sexy as hell because you know we're working on skilling up our craft, bringing you a better YouTube experience and something better to look at. If you want to learn more about getting games by level by level, the link will be in the description. Mr. T is what we're going to call you. Okay. Welcome back. Hey, I'm glad to be here, man. What have you done in your channel since the last video? Okay, so something I noticed is, you know, I was talking about like the handheld gaming and retro on handheld. Uh, but you know these fire sticks you talk a lot about a, um, streaming and Android boxes and fire sticks on your channel right. these things were like dirt cheap a couple months ago yeah on uh, Amazon like, Prime, Prime Day, Day. Yeah. Prime Day so we picked up one and um, I thought to myself well if you didn't have like an expensive computer or like a gaming computer or anything connected to your TV to emulate I mean could you still do uh, emulation and play like your retro games on something that's 19 bucks mm -hmm. that a ton of people a lot of your viewers have these yeah a lot mm -hmm. of people have these things and so for 19 20 bucks and another 10 bucks for a controller and nothing else added mm -hmm. am I able to do Nintendo Super Nintendo Sega Atari all that same stuff that I've been doing like on the handhelds and doing with I have a gaming computer connected to my TV but not everybody does that you right. know, not, not everybody's want to build a eight hundred twelve hundred dollar computer and have it connected to tv you got a 19 dollar device that you can you know do all your old school stuff which is what, what we're all about so if some when someone comes to your channel and they want to you know get the games onto a fire stick about how long would that process take them if there's someone who's not technically inclined by following your videos maybe half an hour that's it yeah oh my goodness yeah. my goodness because you know uh the tutorials that I make and I do, I, I go through step by step and I base a lot on requests too. Right. So it's, you know, I try to take it from uh, the perspective of somebody that's never emulated before and they got their fire stick to watch Netflix. Exactly. But man, I'd like to play some Super Nintendo. Yeah. You know, step away so, from it. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I take it from that base level, not like from the level of somebody that's been doing this a long time or somebody that's, that's technically savvy. Exactly. But just, a B C D. How do you get like you can have a, you can do everything you need to do to this thing as far as putting uh, emulators and uh, connecting controller. You can do everything like I said within half an hour or so with a smartphone. Mm -hmm. So you can connect your smartphone to your Fire Stick. Same people. Some people use their smartphone for their controller already. Right. Right. Um, so you could use your smartphone to push those programs onto your Fire Stick. You don't even have to have a PC. Yep, you don't same. have to have a laptop. Don't have to have anything. Because not but... everybody, you know, not everybody does. I mean, people are moving away from that stuff. People are like tablets, right. smartphones, tablets. A lot of people don't even have a personal computer anymore. Nope. And you can so, get all the gaming you need. Yep. And so I also talked about gaming and you can get the girl and you can obviously <laughs> see Mr. Level by Level has a hot level by level <laughs> wife. And we're going to talk about some of their union came about because they both have a love of games. So Miss Level by Level, it's your turn to speak. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about how gaming brought you and Mr. Level by Level together. Well, I grew up in the household that we had the Nintendo and mom would play, dad would play, my brother would play, I would play. And 
one of our favorite pastimes when we were dating, when we were younger, was to sit around and play video games. What were some of your favorites? Oh, my personal favorite was Goldeneye. You like Goldeneye? Love Goldeneye. Oh. I actually beat it probably a couple of times, and we would sit down and have marathons. He would play, beat it, then I would turn around and play that whole game all the way through. Wow. Now, have <laughs> you had a chance to play some games on the Fire Stick since he's been doing these? I have not, but he did load a personal favorite, which is uh, Castlevania Symphony of the Night. So I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> see, to see fellas. I told you, <laughs> when you can find that lady that loves games, <laughs> when you can find that lady that loves games, you will never have to worry about divorce ever again. <laughs> it's not even going to be in your vocabulary. Oh, go ahead, Terrence. I'm, I'm well, sorry. Well, no, sorry. We, um, we, we got together when we were teenagers mm -hmm. and very young. And even now, so she helps me with my channel. I do co-op gaming mm -hmm. on like Nintendo co-op gaming to you know or old school retro co-op, which a lot of newer games really kind of fell away from the co-op thing. They did. I don't yeah. know why, but anyway, it's like local co-op. Right. So we, we'll, you know, if I put together uh, like we're doing Bubble Bobble. Still trying to. So Bubble, Bubble Bobble for <laughs> Nintendo, and it's a hard game, it's hard. but it's fun. Yeah. And in one of my Bubble Bobble videos, I accidentally left the microphone on. <laughs> and it's me and her talking and I'm like oh hey you need to do this I'll, I got your back I'll I'll get behind you and I'll shoot all this stuff and we were totally talking through the whole game where usually I go back and voice over my videos right. and and it's more sound it's like you know war scripted I said no nah, I'm gonna go with that video and so we did the video and I just left the original audio in, and you could hear us strategizing and <laughs> working and, together and working really together working together and stuff like that so <laughs> You know, not only does it have a deeper, goes back to when we were teenagers and we were kids, um, e but even now. Right. So mm -hmm. she's helping me on the channel. We're having a, a good time. Yeah. We sit down instead of like, one of us sitting on one end of the couch and the other sitting on the other couch and like, she's watching one of her shows and I'm playing on a, a tablet or something. We're, we're playing some Nintendo together. Right. Mm -hmm. That's why I say gaming has the impact of keeping bonds together. <laughs> You're not going to get in trouble. You don't have to worry about the other spouse being out somewhere doing something. Who knows what? You're there together. Now to get you guys closed out and thank you for your time and coming by. Um, what's going to be the future? What can people expect as the future of your channel? Because you're helping them learn how to get games on their systems absolutely free. Um, I think you mentioned you might start going through some tutorials of some of the best devices they can get on there, they can use for gaming or what may happen. So, uh, first of all, I'm very budget minded. Mm -hmm. So, I always go budget first. Okay. So, my can, subscribers love that. <laughs> what can you do with a, on, a, on a budget? Right. You know, what can you do and not have to learn a whole lot of stuff? That's like, that's that's a lot of my goal okay. and keep it keep it retro but when I say retro everything 10 years and older so that's kind of like the the large bubble that the channel lives in okay um, but for the future you know I just bought a, the domain name level by level or lblgaming.com right. so I'm gonna build a website have like forums and stuff like that mm -hmm. on there where it's more resources than just the YouTube if you're asking about the future right. of the channel okay. you know uh, having some social media presence having because uh, you've got a Facebook page now correct? I just got one started okay um, I don't have anything on there yet but I did start uh, LBL gaming on Facebook a Facebook page gotcha. so I do have stuff like that that's the future Okay. of where it's going is giving more giving people more outlets so that they can contact me or we can I can move it into what they need understand as far as the tutorials what devices to get that kind of thing and help them out yeah. yep well ladies and gentlemen I know my subscribers like things free and cheap or as close <laughs> to cheap as possible if you want to get into retro gaming and you want to get it step by step nice and slow from one process to the other one this is going to be your channel to go to thank you for coming by Thank, Thank you, you for coming. Yes. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. Go check them out. Um, these things make great Christmas gifts, too. If you want to do Christmas gifts on the cheap, you can just go buy yourself a streaming device, watch this video, put thousands of games on it. It didn't cost you anything but the streaming device. Yes. And we will check in with them next time, and we'll continue to watch them grow. And until the next Sex is Hell video, we'll see you. Wave them. Say goodbye. Check out their channel. <laughs>